at your service.
Agents, potions, and recipes for sale, if you're interested in alchemical wares. I knew better than to think my prosperity would go unnoticed. It seems all my success helps others instead of myself. Generosity is not something seen that often here. If not in my neighbors, I might place my trust in you. I'll donate to the poor. And why not to you as well? I came to Edessa a few years back. Used to live up in Galette, in the Red Marches. A shame about what happened there, if what I hear is true. Some fanatics, calling themselves the Cult of Balin, are sacrificing people to their god. Or so's the rumor. I've wandered to Tyr nearly all my life. There's a trove of reagents that can save your life, if you know how to use them. It's a nice enough place if the gnomes take a shine to what you can do. I can make potions like their greatest, so I get to do trade in the Arcadium. I'll be here. What? Yes. Got the forge hot, stranger. If you need repair work for armor or weapons, I'm your man. Aye? And I suppose you're here to preach the virtues of helping my lazy neighbors, more like buzzards. I... I've been there before. I know what life is like in the gutters. I'll pay my part, aye. But it's you that's more deserving, I think. Here's some coin. I came here with nothing, but managed to build myself a nice slice of life. The gnomes even invest some money here. Was one of the wretches working for Motus Mining in Apatir. Got out before the sickness gods rest them, but I've been here for years now. Aye, a vile thing in Apatir. Spread like a cold, killed like a plague. 
I can provide you with some smithing if you need. Repairs or salvaging, whatever's at hand. All right then. shops in Odessa, but none as good as mine. Why not drop a few coin here? Share them with who? With... Oh, I see. It's not enough that I scrape out something for myself. You can't succeed in this city without someone coming to collect. You mean it, don't you? You actually care about them. Fine, I'll give my part. And thanks for your compassion. We weren't raised here, but it's home well enough. But the only place in Detea that doesn't feel like the wind will blow it away. Came here with my father more than a few years back. Poor dad died a few years ago. And I just took up the business when he did. Been here since. Don't rightly got one type of stock here. I tend to sell all manner of things you might need while roaming the waste. Please come by again. What? You found the letter. But why would scholar Erencourt want it to be sent and lost? She commissioned the letter in the first place. I... Uh, it is above my station to question her. But there is a higher plan at work. Please, stranger, find Erencourt and learn what is happening. She can be found in the Isles. Probably in the Basilica Nostra. She needs to be confronted with the information we found regarding the letter. Many of us come far from our homeland for the opportunity of success. A new city opens up societal ranks. We've been a Scrivener in the Domus for over ten years. I'm often called upon to compose official correspondence and letters of a diplomatic nature. The Domus Politica handles all of the documentation that's needed to support the Templar diplomacy. The Gnomes do not acknowledge war as an acceptable circumstance. We cannot condone either side until a peace is reached. The benefits either side may gain from such conflict are short-term when compared to the decades of rebuilding and fortifying that such a war will necessitate. The Templars exemplify what's great about our people. Wisdom, ingenuity, bravery, and justice. The Templars exemplify what's great about our people. Wisdom, no more society is led by few who rely on the efforts of many. Here in the walls, we work so that they are free to lead us more effectively. Fair enough. Require something? Ah, the guest of Sandstone Villa. How can the Domus Politica be of service today?
Just as well. Yes? Tidings. You don't believe me? Take a look at this. <clears throat> what is it? I've heard that someone was helping my subordinate, Corden. It seems he has lost a very, very important letter. While I applaud your diligence in tracking this to me, I'm sad to say that Corden's error is grievous. He will be punished for losing the letter. That is a half-truth. I requested the letter of Corden, true, but it was not my idea. That came from a higher source. The Templars have reached a tentative quorum regarding our stance in the war, but a cautious few requested I draft this letter. A Templar must be obeyed. But what can be done when they give conflicting orders? So I had the letter written, and Corden lost it. I... damn it all. I knew that Dirty Traveler was not capable of performing even the simplest of tasks. I will not allow you the privilege of extorting me. I will resign my position and name Corden as my replacement. We shall see how he fares. I would be very careful if I were you. You are known to the Templars, and it was never their intention to treat you lightly. While my background lies in the study of magical acuity contextualized by race, somehow I ended up being a basilica liaison to the Domus concerning Fae and Alfar. It is the product of centuries of learning. Here we distill the experiences of our race into axioms, knowledge that future generations may live by. The scholars first found this crater brimming with strange potential. In studying the area, more equipment than people came, until a city was born. I see. You wish to speak? What? You... 
You won't believe this. I've been presented with the opportunity to join the Basilica Nostra. It must have been from your help. I never thought in my wildest years. I only hope to correct a mistake. It will take time to be approved. But here is your reward with my thanks. Fair enough. something. All I've got to my names, my father's trousers, and a bad hangover. So piss off! Yeah, yeah. So the scriptures of Matharu have been handed to us. I too have been asked by Reddle to hand these words to the denizens of all that can help. Indeed, Mitharu smiles on a few, and it is their responsibility to share such providence. Your service will not go unrewarded. It is one of sorts. It is a board of petitions made by those of the Hospitalis Quarters. I keep it for the good of this place. The gnomes do not keep the faith of Mitharu. That much is enough for me. Mitharu is the great order of the world, who grants purpose and structure to all life. Mitharu and Redelmain guide my work. Redelmain has much, but he understands that he cannot enact the change that could help us without jeopardizing all of our safety. Be pious. I? Well now, the market's hiked their prices up again. Guess I'll just have to start trimming the stew some more.
ready. Do not miss Leogriff's many marvels. Don't you just love the luminary leaf? I could sit here reading for days and not reach past the first shelf. I'm studying in preparation to join the Scolia Arcana. Is there any other reason to be in Rathir? This is where magic lives. War is ugly. Perhaps if the generals did more reading, the scholars did more fighting, then everyone would better understand the pointlessness of violence. Archsage, you know Rathir as well as any of us. Its secrets, its power. I should be asking you about the city. How do you know my brother? Wait. He's dead? Ram. No, it can't be. I told him. I told him this would happen, but he wouldn't listen. Pig-headed fool! War isn't the way. Anyone who knows history knows that. But Ram was too impatient for words. He was so brash, so... brave. We couldn't have been more different, Ram and I. He always excelled at hunting, fighting, combat. Me? I was always the family joke. A boy with his nose in a book. What Ram never knew, and will never know now, is that I admired him greatly. I wanted to be like him. Strong. Confident. Passionate. True, I believe that the Crystal War is a doomed affair, but my criticism of it was more about keeping my brother home. Home. Safe. Miss Leogriff's many marvels. Uh. Rathia sails with you this day. Godspeed. Tuatha are relentless. We get the ships are loading now for Melsen Shear. Are you ready to board? Suit yourself.
students of magic, masters of spells. Stand aside. Lunar gardens are enchanting. The captain of the watch. Welcome to our temple. They were primarily sent to the strongholds of the plains of Arathel, but... Any that you find will be gladly welcomed and thanked with gold. Goodbye. A stroll up here always comes. Welcome. Fast. The major hesitates is lost. You must be confident. You must strike. Ah! A newly recruited student. Welcome. Please join us. We're simply preparing for some field research. Part of the training involves sending initiates to Gloom Thicket, a Fey Hollow in Akatha. It gives my pupils first hand experience with Fey magics. Now that I think of it, I believe you're overdue for some field research yourself. Care to investigate? I try to give the initiate some perspective on the scope and types of magic. Part of this involves seeing the magic of the Fae. Groom Thicket was an ideal spot for them to observe Fae magic. But lately, they haven't been returning. Something's preying on the initiates. Like I said, it's in the Akatha. Given the environment and the presence of Morgan, I'd say a banshee and priestess has awakened. Dangerous things. I suggest fireballs to the head repeatedly until it stops moving. Find the Banshee and Priestess that's killing our initiates and put it down. It's nestled in the flooded plains of Akatha. Never used to be more than Murg in there, but now it's something more serious. There are a number of advantages to basing ourselves in Rathir. The plains are among the most magical of the regions in these lands. And we receive special patronage from the Orbacant, the rules of Rathir, for the purposes of furthering the study of magic. Magic is reaching all races. If we do not know what its limitations and strengths are, then we are in for darker times. I oversee the training of initiates here in the Rathir chapter. Defensive work, mostly, to protect themselves while doing research or going on expeditions. Always an honor, Arch Sage. Is there any way I can be of help? I provide all members of the Scolia Arcana with the tools and items their training might require of them. 
Worked here my whole life. I've seen things shocking enough to make you blind. It takes a certain kind to last long in this order, I think. Largest city on the continent. At least, it was once, before the gnomes refused to quit adding to Odessa. Goodbye. Yes. Wards can be a tricky thing if you don't know how to handle them. Another time. I can do to be of assistance, Archsage. I can think of no greater mystery than what it must have been like for the first alchemists to sample the potions they made. I only wish I had been there. You can find me here. Uh. Greetings, Arch Sage.
Are you here for the evaluation? I've already administered the written copies. This will have to be an oral exam. I oversee the library in the Rathir chapter. 
Many walk the road of knowledge, but I make sure they do so in an orderly manner. The Rathir chapter has some of the finest collections of manuscripts in the plains of Erethel. I guarantee it. Members of all ranks, regardless of their skill, must always know the value of research and perception. I understand your studies with us are a unique situation, so let's consider this practice. Take this book, read it, and understand what it means to be part of our order. The Omnibus Arcana is a staple of the education in our institution. All first-year students are given a copy to study. The lessons involve an introduction to the rigors of studying magic, as well as the value of applying yourself to your studies. Each book is different for every user, but they all impart the same basic knowledge. This is the Omnibus Arcana. It is a magical text that holds the collected knowledge of our order. It is also imbued with a certain form of intelligence. Follow its directions as you would my own. This is an introductory text given to all first-year students. It's considered canon. The test begins in the courtyard. From there, you're on your own. Where was I? Greetings, I say.
day. Arch Sage, welcome. The City Watch never... Good day to you. Curios, talismans, items... ...of power. Every morning, fresh soldiers board warships on the burn. Every night, the dead and wounded are carried from the ships.
Greetings, Wanderer. Not miss Leogriff's many marvels. Look at it all. <clears throat> Move along, citizen. Excellent job. You've earned a Scolia Arcana stipend, if nothing else. Now, let's see what you've learned. What was the point of your final lesson? Yes, that is correct. I see you have a promising future in our order. Were it so easy to summarize an institution like the Scolia Arcana in a few short words, books, I think, do it slightly more justice. What? Oh, right.
Did you watch? Do not miss Leogriff's many marvels. City Watch, move along. Before you lies the Scolia Arcana. All are welcome upon our grounds, though we ask you do not disturb the students. Inquiry was successful. Please, take this to cover travel and any other expenses. Greetings. 